Now at noon, a Pembroke Pines mother is facing a child abuse charge for what investigators say she did to her son. She's accused of burning his chest with a hot iron. CBS 4's Ted Scouten is live at the Broward County Jail in Fort Lauderdale with more on this. Ted? Yeah, Elliot, that mother is still here at the Broward County Jail. However, she will be released later on today. Now, in court this morning, her attorney asked the judge for, for the judge to, po to set a low bond. The prosecutor asked for a high bond. The judge inexplicably said she doesn't have to post a bond at all. Ms. Jean, you are charged with aggravated child abuse. Tamicha Jean is a 32-year-old mother of three accused of abusing her nine-year-old son. Pembroke Pines police say someone called the child abuse hotline to report she burned her son's chest with an iron, saying she was infuriated that he forgot to bring home some paperwork from school. She's been residing here in South Florida since 1999. Her court-appointed attorney told the judge Jean has lived here a long time and works and asked for a low bond. Mr. Romero, what are you asking for? Judge, what I'm going to be asking for is a $1,500 bond on uh, Ms. Jean's behalf. Prosecutors suggested the judge impose a significantly higher bond. Even with ties to the community, job, uh, and her ability to post bond, I'm sorry. The violence alleged in this case is just so aggravating that it just completely outweighs any mitigating factors, Your Honor. Uh, I'm going to be requesting a $20,000 bond. Judge Christopher Pohl went a completely different direction, saying she has to pay nothing to get out of jail, released on her own recognizance. What I'm going to do is um, I'm going to release her ROR to uh, level two pretrial release with a monitor. I'm going to ask that um, pretrial waive the cost of the uh, GPS monitor. She is to have no contact in any form or manner with her three children until further order of the um, family court division. Can you talk to us about Tamicha? No. We tried speaking to Jean's girlfriend after the hearing. She said nothing, but did take a moment to flip us off while going down the escalator. And Jean has a hearing in family court at 1.30. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Ted Scouten, CBS 4 News.